guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Sweetie Dongo, and today in this video, I'm gonna do some DIYs using only one item, and that is rope. Now, I had some excess ropes from my previous DIYs. That that was the a mini shoe closet transformation and that is where I got the idea from. Now I thought that instead of letting them go in waste, why don't we, you know, turn these ropes into some fun DIYs that can, uh, you know, that can be made as some home decors. So in today's D uh, DIY, I'm gonna use two types of rope. That is the uh, white one and the jute ones. Now the white ones are, they look something like this, you guys have seen it in my previous video. I'm using accessory row right now. This much was the excess and I've also bought the another bundle. Now that costed me 75 rupees and this jute rope right here, the little one, costed me only 5 rupees. Now it was that, it was like that cheap, okay? So I've bought plenty of these. Now I'm gonna do some very fun DIYs using these ropes and you know like the rope material right here this is a so boboish it would turn your um, you know it would turn your room decor to be a kind of boboish so I guess this would be the cheapest and the easiest DIY that I'll be doing in my channel and I'm very excited to see how these would turn out to be so let's get started so guys, the first DIY that I'm gonna do is this a jute rope vase. Now it looks really beautiful as a room decor piece. So with this, I took an empty wine bottle and I've cleaned it properly and I've also taken out its label. Now all I'm gonna do is just take the jute rope and tie it around the bottle using the fevicol. It's as simple as that. It takes a bit long time but the results are really good. So guys this is the final look and it surely looks like it has been purchased from the market. So the second DIY is the DIY planter and I have this cute little plant but I really don't like the pot. So just like the previous DIY I am gonna use the jute rope to give it a new touch. As I've told before, the DIYs this time is really simple and this DIY is same as before. With the help of the fevicol, I'm tying the jute rope around the pot and it looks really nice. So after covering the pot, I'm using the end to make a bow out of it and give it a final touch.
So guys, the third DIY is a rope mat. Now with the help of it, I've made a small cozy corner outside my room. It can be made in any shape and size. If you make it small, it can also be used as a poster. So for this, I'm gonna take the rope and I'm using the fevicol to stick it around. I'm gonna make a, a circle shape out of it and you can also continue it until uh, you reach uh, to your desired level of its size. So finally, this is how your rope mat looks like. Now the fourth and my favorite DIY is this lamp which I found on my storeroom. Now the same logic applies here also. Using only fevicol and jute rope, I'm covering the upper part of my lamp. It looks really torn out so I've also applied the fevicol and paper to make it more stronger than before. I'm very happy that I'm reusing my old lamp. So this is how it looks after it's done. Now using only fevicol and rope, we can turn all things into something usable and fancy. So guys, these were the fun 5 minutes DIYs that you can try it on your home and use it as the room decor or the home decor as your wish. Now I personally loved the planter and the lamp because I had found that lamp on my storeroom. Uh, so a few weeks back I went to my uh, storeroom to find that what are the things that I can reuse or recycle. And I thought that it would be really nice uh, you know if I uh, use it with the jute rope and I had uh, seen the pictures on the internet but I just got that idea and I just tried it out it looks really adorable I love 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 the lamp and the planter it looks really cute so guys this is it for today's video and if you guys like this video don't forget to subscribe to my channel like and 
share this video with your friends and I'll be seeing you in my next video. Till then, bye bye.